A Crown of Thorns The Chidima Adetshina Story Chidima Adetshina, a young woman with dreams as bright as the African sun, set her sights on the coveted Miss South Africa crown. Her journey was not just about beauty and grace, but also about representing a new era of inclusivity and diversity. Little did she know that her journey would be fraught with controversy, challenging her identity and shaking the very foundations of her world. The path to the crown was lined with unexpected obstacles and heart-wrenching dilemmas. Adetshina's story is one of ambition, heritage, and the complexities of belonging in a world grappling with the remnants of colonialism and the ever-present spectre of xenophobia. Her narrative is a reflection of the broader struggles faced by many in post-colonial societies. Born to a Nigerian father and a mother of both South African and Mozambican descent, Adetshina embodies the vibrant tapestry of Africa's diverse heritage. Her mixed lineage was both a source of pride and a point of contention. Her participation in the Miss South Africa pageant ignited a firestorm of debate, questioning her eligibility to represent a nation still grappling with its own identity in the wake of apartheid. The discussions were intense, reflecting deep-seated issues within the society. Some saw her as a symbol of unity, a testament to South Africa's progress, while others viewed her dual heritage as a threat to national identity. The nation was divided, with passionate arguments on both sides. As Adetshina gracefully navigated the pageant stage, a storm was brewing behind the scenes. The spotlight on her was both a blessing and a curse, bringing her unprecedented attention and scrutiny. Allegations of identity theft against her mother cast a long shadow over her aspirations threatening to derail her dreams and expose a tangled web of legal complexities. The accusations were serious, adding another layer of difficulty to her already challenging journey. A Mother's Shadow Allegations and Identity The controversy surrounding Chidima Adichina took a dramatic turn when allegations of identity theft were levelled against her mother, shaking the very foundation of her participation in the pageant. These accusations, like a bolt from the blue, sent shockwaves through the nation and cast a dark cloud over Adashina's quest for the crown, leaving many in disbelief. The allegations centred around claims that her mother had misrepresented her own citizenship status potentially jeopardising Adetshina's claim to South African nationality and raising questions about the integrity of the pageant. As the scandal unfolded, public opinion became sharply divided, with heated debates erupting both online and offline. Some rallied behind Adetshina, offering unwavering support and condemning the allegations as a witch hunt, fuelled by xenophobia and prejudice believing in her innocence and right to compete. Others, however, questioned her eligibility to represent South Africa, arguing that the allegations against her mother raised serious concerns about her own citizenship status and whether she truly deserved to be in the competition. The weight of the allegations and the relentless media scrutiny proved too heavy a burden for the aspiring beauty queen to bear, affecting her mental and emotional well-being. In a heart-wrenching decision, Adet Sheena withdrew from the Miss South Africa pageant, choosing to protect her family and her own well-being from the maelstrom of controversy, leaving her dreams shattered but her dignity intact. A new stage. Representing Nigeria. In the aftermath of her withdrawal from the Miss South Africa pageant, Chidima Adetshina found herself at a crossroads. 
The controversy surrounding her identity and the allegations against her mother had left her feeling vulnerable and uncertain about her future. However, fate, it seemed, had other plans for the resilient young woman. An invitation arrived from an unexpected quarter. Nigeria, the land of her father's birth, beckoned her to represent the nation in the prestigious Miss Universe competition. This invitation, a beacon of hope in a time of darkness, offered Adetshina a chance to reclaim her narrative and showcase her beauty and intelligence on the world stage. Embracing this new opportunity with open arms, Adetshina embarked on a journey that would redefine her relationship with her heritage and challenge the very notion of national identity. Her decision to represent Nigeria was met with mixed reactions, with some applauding her courage and resilience, while others criticised her for seemingly turning her back on South Africa. Stripped away, loss of South African identity. Just when it seemed that Chidima Adetshina had found a path forward, fate dealt her another cruel blow, one that would change her life forever. The South African Department of Home Affairs citing the ongoing investigation into the serious allegations against her mother, revoked Adachina's South African identity and travel documents without any prior warning. This decision, a devastating blow to Adachina's sense of belonging and identity, stripped her of the only nationality she had ever known and cherished. Overnight, she became a stranger in her own land, her future shrouded in uncertainty, fear, and a deep sense of loss. The revocation of her documents meant that she could no longer live, work, or travel freely in South Africa, the country she had always called home and where she had built her life. The South African authorities' decision to revoke Adetshina's citizenship sparked immediate outrage and condemnation from human rights groups and legal experts, who argued that the move was not only unjust, but also highly disproportionate to the situation at hand. They argued passionately that Adat Sheena, as an individual, should not be held responsible for the alleged actions of her mother, and that revoking her citizenship amounted to a severe violation of her fundamental human rights leaving her stateless and vulnerable. As we delve deeper into the story, we begin to investigate the claims that have surfaced. Our journey takes us through a maze of information where facts and fiction often blur. We sift through documents, interview key players and analyze data to uncover the truth. It's a meticulous process but every piece of evidence brings us one step closer to understanding the full picture. Stay with us as we navigate this complex web and reveal what really happened. Adet Sheena's story is one of dual heritage, a blend of two rich cultures. Her experiences navigating both worlds have shaped her unique perspective. This duality, while enriching, also presents its own set of challenges and opportunities. The public and media reactions to Adetshina's journey have been varied and complex. Some celebrate her as a symbol of multicultural success, while others question her authenticity and belonging. The media, in particular, has played a significant role in shaping public opinion often highlighting the most sensational aspects of her story. Adetshina's experiences bring to light important issues around nationality, identity and xenophobia. Her story challenges us to rethink our preconceived notions about belonging and acceptance. It also highlights the often harsh realities faced by those who straddle multiple identities in a world that can be quick to judge. Looking to the future, Adachina's journey offers valuable lessons for us all. 
It reminds us of the importance of embracing diversity and fostering inclusive communities. Her story is a testament to the resilience and strength that comes from honoring one's heritage while forging a path forward in a complex world.